Joining us now is Alex Gangitano, White House correspondent for The Hill. Good morning and happy Friday, Alex. Good morning, Mitch. Happy Friday. We have dueling Merrick Garland special counsel investigations. Uh, the DOJ is going to look into classified documents found at Mar-a-Lago, as well as classified documents found all over the place for Joe Biden. Um, what do you make of these two dueling special counsel investigations? Yeah, you know, this this mess that uh, President Biden has found himself in obviously shows a lot of pain parallels with what we um, have been seeing with former President Trump. But of course, there are some differences here. You know, Merrick Garland uh, announced yesterday this special counsel. Um, as you mentioned, there's a special counsel looking into former President Trump's situation. But the White House has been really firm to create some differences here. And, and the media, too, has pointed out the differences between these two cases. Um, one being that the Biden team is really cooperating here and they they're saying, you know, this uh, this is up to DOJ, this is up to the National Archives, and if Merrick Garland wants to uh, appoint a special counsel, he has a uh, full reign, you know, and independence to do what he needs to do, and they um, have stressed so much that they're cooperating. On the other hand, you know, the, the Trump team uh, wasn't handing over documents, and the FBI, in this really unprecedented move, had to go in and seize those documents. So the White House appears to be really cooperating and, and um, allowing Merrick Garland to do whatever he needs to do for all of this to get resolved and under review. And also, importantly, they've said uh, the the president's lawyer said that they think after a review they feel pretty confident that findings will show that these documents were mistakenly uh, placed in these locations. Alex, we got less than a minute to go. Uh, I found this really interesting. I got to credit the New York Times on this one. Every president since Watergate, except for Barack Obama, has faced some special counsel investigation. That is uh, astounding to me. But um, I, I just want to know. Politically, does it make a difference, uh, the differences between those two cases, or is it just going to be used by both sides either way? Right. That is such a good point. I mean, this is all so politicized. Obviously, Democrats pounced on the, the Trump document scandal and have continued to talk about, you know, how reckless former President Trump can be, whereas now d Republicans are uh, pouncing on this scandal, and I think it's going to continue to be a talking point going into the 2024 midterms. I don't think it's going to change many voters' minds, but we'll have to see how it plays out. Thanks for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation in your cable lineup, and don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-based, unbiased coverage.